Her Majesty is renowned for being one of the most recognizable faces in the world, and is often seen in the UK as a beacon of hope and optimism when the country is at its lowest points. The 94-year-old has prided herself on being an ever-present throughout her long reign, which was typified as she welcomed her grandson Prince William, and his wife Kate Middleton, back from their three-day trip across the nation. Joining her were the likes of Prince Charles, Camilla Parker Bowles, Princess Anne and Prince Edward, in a show of unity following their successful visit. The Queen has continued to try and remain active by carrying out visits during the pandemic but has only been able to attend certain functions due to restrictions. She has, however, been able to speak to the public via social programs such as Zoom, meaning her presence has still been felt. This shift, royal expert Camilla Tomini argues, has also seen a move in the public's opinion towards the royal family at a time when controversy has never been far away. She said, It's interesting to see how the Queen has adapted to her new role, which has had to be effectively virtual. This is a woman who throughout her whole reign her motto has been, I need to be seen to be believed. That desire to ensure the public can see her is why, Ms. Tomini explained, the coronavirus pandemic has been difficult for her to manage, as she would normally meet the public while out on duties. Her ability, however, to move effortlessly away from her publicly seen role, and into a more technological sphere, has gone some way to restore faith in the monarchy. Ms. Tomini continued, It's that keep calm and carry on mentality that the Queen epitomizes, it is the stuff of t-shirts, this is why she is renowned as Elizabeth the Stalwart, Elizabeth the Consistent. Shush has always put duty first and so when it comes to times of crisis we expect her to step up to the plate and have this stabilizing, calming effect on the nation. <laughs>